Congratulations on your victory! And a pretty dominant one at that 3 0 in clutch. I gotta ask you guys, how confident were you coming into today? Um, after we lose the uh, same final, I think we actually fixed a lot as a team too. And also there was a lot of kind of draft uh, uh, problem. So it feels like we had a lot of confidence against us CG, which is like, we also had practice before we play same final and then we knew that they're not a better team than us. So definitely like we have so much confidence in it. Dardock, you confident? Yeah, pretty much the same as Houdini. We played CG in 100 Thieves primarily before we played TL in semifinal, and our screens were pretty one-sided versus Clutch, for sure. Now, kind of in the first two games... In the first two games, you had some phenomenal performance in the jungle, basically making it so that Lyra couldn't really do anything. Where do you think that Echo Fox excelled today? Say that again? Where do you think Echo Fox excelled today? Um... I think our, prepare, our preparation was really good, and because of the draft, I could do a bunch of, I guess, unique clears as Olaf, starting in his jungle. And due to the fact that, I mean, in the first game we had Talia, so he couldn't really answer, and the second game, I think, he just played bad. But, uh, yeah, I think my team helped me a lot in the early game, getting me these leads. Great. Well, you have a wonderful team at that. And over the split, it seems like you guys were growing and kind of meshing along with everyone. So compare your performance today in the third place match to maybe your performance throughout the entire split. Huni? Um, yeah, I mean, it's not about happy actually being in third place. It's like three times in a row. But still, you know, there's like summer split, which is like more important for us for the World Championship. And then also we secure for revival. So like, I'm really, really excited for Revivals too, since it's in LA. I hope you guys are actually watching a lot of cheering for LA team too. I mean, definitely time is gonna be, you know, Revivals is gonna be like, proof that, you know, NA better than EU. <laughs> Hell yeah. I mean, we are, but Dardoch. Yeah, double check, you know. We are, but double check. <laughs> Anything to add? No, I mean, yeah, it's obviously not as fun coming here for third, fourth, but mm -hmm. I mean, it's still an opportunity to show that we're a strong team, and I think we did that. Well, you guys do have Rift Rivals ahead of you, a chance to gain some international experience, and Huni, for you to uh, take down Reckless. Any thoughts going into that? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I think my crowd wanted me to say easy, you know. Back to you guys. We have another interview ready on stage, so let's send it back to Avali and Echo Fox's owner. Thanks, guys. I am here with both Stratton and Rick Fox from Echo Fox. Rick, this has been an incredible victory, not only for Echo Fox League of Legends teams, but for the organization in general. The team going from never qualifying for playoffs to making it to the top three. How happy are you with this victory? I never knew third place could feel so good. <laughs> it is amazing. It is really amazing. Uh, I, I would be remiss if I didn't wish two other people were here today right now with us. That is Ahmed and my son, Kyle. Two people that have been there from the beginning. Stratton has been there from the beginning. We are looking across to an amazing esports community, a league community that is out here in Miami. What do you think Stratton should we move to Miami? I'm thinking Miami, I like Miami. <laughs> this is amazing. Uh, our players, Hooney, Dardock, Phoenix, Alltech, and Adrian, all season long have been fighting to improve day in and day out, day in and day out. We've had highs, we've had lows, but man, I tell you, they zoned in today. They played the type of, uh, uh, you know, Aggressive. Yeah, I mean, they, they played who we are. They really showed up and they, they represented who we are. Jared and I talked about it. We talked about it all game. This is just who we are. We're an aggressive team. And so I'm really, uh, I'm really grateful that you guys came out and supported us and supported yeah. I, I do also want to take a second, though, to let, to let Dardock also know that we love him. All of us love him, and we're here with him. This is going to be a great weekend for league, but it's also going to be a, a, a great game tomorrow. And we're so we're so proud that he's still here to be with us today, tomorrow. Wonderful, wonderful. And
and I mean speaking to the improvement of your team, is there anything that you and Stratton would like to say to your players? What do we want to say to our players? We are Echo Fox. Stand tall, be proud. That's what we've been striving for the last year and a half. Become one of those organizations that people talk about when you talk about the, the dynasties and the great organizations in, in sports, not just esports, all of sports, like he was with our Lakers, right? And like we're going to be for the next decade. Uh, yeah, it's been, uh, it's been, it's been a, an amazing three years uh, growing as an organization but being welcomed into this uh, community by all of you and uh, watching our brand grow with amazing partners like the Yankees that are here today and so many other people. I see Khalid, I see the Dashies, I see people that have been there from day one, Haley who keeps it going. These are all people that are the backbone of our organization. Our coaching staff were amazing this, uh, this weekend and it's not easy to bounce back. Mm -hmm. We had a difficult loss to a really good team and tomorrow two great teams are gonna go at it. The beauty of it is that as exciting as it is right now here, it's the spring split. This thing <laughs> bills and bills and bills. Summer is right around the corner, and I can't wait. We're still trying to make it the world's, and we still want to win a world championship. So we're not going anywhere. Not going anywhere. I am excited to see where Echo Fox ends up in the summer. Both of you guys, thank you so thank much, you and congratulations. Back thank to you guys. Thank you.